Hi guys, it's Rachel. Today I have an all new recipe on how to make green tea affogato. This will be perfect for the holiday season that's coming up. Here are all the ingredients you'll need for this delicious affogato. So there are two different options on how to make this green tea affogato. If you're looking for a more organic and natural way, go ahead and use real green tea in a tea bag. If you want to be slightly unhealthier like me, go ahead and use artificial green tea mix. I think it looks better just because it's more green and it also tastes a little bit sweeter, which I like. So I prepared two different kinds of matcha tea. So I used a milk version and just a straight up matcha booster. And once you've prepared your tea, just mix it with hot water or whatever the directions say. Go ahead and whip up half a cup of heavy cream. Once the heavy cream is nice and stiff, load it into a pastry bag fitted with a swirl or star tip. Okay, so now here's the fun part. First, I'm going to load up some of that straight dark green matcha tea booster into the bottom of my ice cream sundae. And because I don't have vanilla ice cream at home, I'm just using pistachio ice cream, which works just as well. But now I'm adding about two scoops of the ice cream into the sundae bowl. Now I'm going to layer on some of that milk green tea that I made earlier, and then add on another layer of pistachio ice cream. And finally, I'm gonna drizzle some of that green tea matcha booster on the top of the ice cream. Remember that heavy cream we whipped up earlier? Now we are going to swirl some of it on top of the ice cream. As a finishing touch, I'm going to dust the top with some green tea powder. And I found these little green tea snacks in my pantry, so I decided to use it as a little detail or a little decoration for the affogato. And now you're all ready to enjoy. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure to give it a thumbs up and like it down below. And I'll see you next week for an all new video. Bye.